Tell the people what it's like sitting in that seat right there. You gotta be a warrior. <laughs> Actually, can you handle it? Nope, he can't handle it. He crying. Ain't nobody crying. I ain't sitting there. I ain't even complaining. Nothing. Sending them home tired and hungry. Your wife already waiting on you? She in, she in the driveway. <laughs> Look, as soon as I pull up, he's jumping out and running. <laughs> okay, Alan. You want to work tomorrow, bro? Yeah. He ain't here want to work. <laughs> I get up in the morning for him. No, I don't need you tomorrow, bro. So you use me today, but you don't want me tomorrow. Yeah, you lay down him. I saw, man, he going to lay down. And I done fed him. Boy, I did, look, I did ate that foot long, he laid down. <laughs> Bro, you ain't that fuck long, he's gonna hit down on me. So, if you sit in that seat, that means you got to come on with him. Huh? If I hire somebody and they sit in that seat, that means they got to come on with him. Oh, man, heck yeah. <laughs> now, was I cracking a whip on you? No. Was I breathing down your neck? No. Only thing I want you to do is run that trimmer, right? Yeah, keep trying to keep up with the mower. Keep up with that mower. Look, listen. When you see Gip, uh, when you see a Gibson's lawn service truck, and you happen to see through these tenant windows, and you see somebody sitting in that seat, just know it's either temporary or they earn that spot. Just know, whoever's sitting in that seat, they shirt, they shirt soaking wet from sweating, because when they grab that trimmer, I want them running. <laughs> I want them running. You'll make a thousand dollars a week, but you got to grab that drum and run. You got to run. 